100% hard work and perseverance, but it turns out there was something else that played a big role, and that's the technology that she trained with. A long line to greet a gold medalist. I brought her some nice big yellow sunflowers because they, they reminded me of gold medals. In front of fans, Erica Weed proudly shows off her Olympic gear for Maria. My Canadian wrestling singlet. Um, you know, this is what I wore when I competed that day. But there's one piece of clothing that wasn't on the world stage that played a key role in her victory. It's this biometric training vest with built-in sensors that measure her progress, letting her know if she's training at the right level. We have the best exercise physiologists in the world, like working with us and for us, and, and for them to be able to take this data and to implement it in training, I mean, I felt more fit than I ever felt when I stepped on the mats on the 18th, and I really felt ready. And now the Canada Science and Technology Museum wants to be a part of the story, showcasing science and sport. Weaves gear will be housed in an exhibit at this museum come 2017 when it reopens after undergoing two years of major renovations. It shows the spectrum of where wearable technology can take you, and if, if it's used on a wrestling mat, then it's also used everywhere else, so it's a great narrative for us to be able to speak about. Using sport to highlight the benefits from the tech world. I'm a huge advocate for you know, women in technology and women in science, and um, to be featured in the museum, I hope it's an inspiration for all young girls. Inspiring Canada's future. It just shows that a lot of work can pay off, and that it doesn't matter uh, if you start out small, but it can pay off. And Graham, we're about to meet some of Erica Weed's fans coming up at 7.30 when she arrives. Guests are supposed to arrive around 7. They're going to be waving flags for her. And we're in for a special announcement. Now, when I asked what that was, they said it had to stay a secret until 7.30. So they'll have to check back on that one. Graham. All right, CTV's Megatron.